everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your Wi-Fi internet issues on your Xbox One. Now, the first thing we want to do is go up to settings right here, and then go on over to General Network Settings, and select this. And we want to check our signal strength to make sure that we have a good signal. So we can see in the upper right side of the screen that I have like four bars out of four. Now, if these aren't to the max, we want to make sure that our Xbox One is close enough to our wireless router. So if you do have only like one or two bars, try moving your Xbox One closer to your router. Then also we want to perform a quick test network speed and statistics test. So under this screen, we can get additional information. We can check the download speed if we're connected, but we'll also get the wireless strength right here in a percentage format. So I'm at 88%, 100% being the best, and I'm probably about 30 meters away from my wireless router. So we want to try to get this up as high as we possibly can. If it's too low, we might be dropping our internet Wi-Fi connection, and that is why we're not able to connect. Now let's go through additional settings that we can try. So on this screen, we can go to forget wireless network, and then we can try reconnecting to it. So let's go to set up wireless connection press X to scan for additional networks. So here's my connection right here. Let's go to it and then reconnect to your wireless router. All right, so I'm reconnecting now that I type in my password and it's checking the connection. All right, looks like we're good to continue. Now, if that doesn't work or do anything, let's go down to advanced settings and let's go to alternate Mac address right here. And we could try clearing the wireless Mac address right here. So let's go to clear and you'll have to restart your Xbox One. So another thing that we could try under this section is go to alternate port selection, and we can type in a different port. So let's go to manual, and we can select a different port. So if we're at like 49155, let's just try something at the bottom. Go to this one right here, and then go to continue. So if the MAC address and the port selection didn't work, let's go to DNS settings right now, and then go to manual under here. And a lot of times this will fix your issues. So type in for the primary DNS 8.8.8.8. .8 Press the button with three lines on it and go to next. Then type in 8.8.4.4. So if it's not your signal strength and it's not your settings for your IP or your DNS or anything like that, we want to perform a hard reset of our router and modem and our Xbox One. So let's hold down the Xbox button and then go to turn off right here. Now simply unplug your Xbox One from the wall outlet for at least one minute and then plug it back in just in case there's something wrong with your Xbox One and then turn it back on. Now do the same thing for your wireless router and your modem. So this is a wireless router combo with my modem. So it's everything in one. And then here's my gaming router back here. So I have two of them. So if you see all these lights lit up as blue, you're good to go. But you want to go to the back of it and then unplug it from the wall outlet for at least one to two minutes. And then check all these cables back here too. You can try unplugging every cable and then plugging it back in. And make sure the coaxial cable right here is tight. You can take this off and then re-screw it on in case there's not a good connection. And then plug this back in. And then after about two to three minutes, all your connections should come back online. So these lights should begin to blink. Just look at them. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on Your Six Tech.